Hello, this is Ronan Amog, and in this screencast I'm going to show you how to produce an open XML document from SAP and then try to manual edit contents, some contents of this document. Let's first go inside uh, to the customized screen of the open XML uh, templates and uh, let's look at one, one of the few templates we have here. Let's look at this one, uh, the live uh, template, and we'll watch the template itself on the docx. And as we see, we have here some uh, content controls fields and one uh, word, word table. Okay, let's close it and go to the program that we generate this template. This template. Uh, we generate the documents from this template and let's uh, put about uh, 20, 20 files, we generate 20 files from this template. Let's run it. We see the documents are creating. And now let's take one of them, let's take the third one. We see the data was inserted into the content control and the table is created. So let's close it and now a nice trick here, as we know, or we don't know, uh, the open XML documents are zipped contents. So if I change the extension of the file, take a look, I change it to zip, and then I change the file itself. We have a zip file, and now this zip file, I want to extract it to here and I see a lot of uh, directories and more, uh, more XML files and some other files and uh, I will go to the document XML I will open it I will see a lot of uh, XML tags very very confusing let's leave it now and go to its contents and I will copy this contents and I'll show you a nice trick here. I'll go to an XML editor. In this case, I use uh, the Eclipse. Now, I want to format it and I will go to one of, one of the text here. Let's see if I can find something. Let's look at VBE LN. We have tag like this. And what can we write here? Okay. We'll change the VBE LN. We we'll change it to 998877 Okay. Now let's copy it again. And we'll go to here and we'll edit, we'll edit the document XML. Let's clear what we have inside and put the new content that we've changed and close it, save it and now, what I'm going to do is take all these files and we'll add it to Archive. So, we'll zip all these files together. You will understand it in the, in the next few words. We'll add it to it and call it test a minute. <laughs> I call it test edit dot zip. Okay. So we've got the test edit dot zip. Now let's take it and change its extension back to docx. Wow, we have a 
docx document. Let's open it. What we can see, what we can see is that we've changed this tag vbln. We've changed it. We changed the context, as you remember, to 9988776644, and the other data contents were the same are the same. So we've changed it using the XML editor. We've changed the contents, and then we zipped we zipped all the files together, and then we took the file itself, the zip file and we've changed its extension back to docx. So what we've done here is unzip, change the data, and zip it again, and move it to docx template, docx uh, format, excuse me. So that's all for this time. I hope to see you next time. Thank you very much.